What's up guys, it's your biggest games and today I wanted to talk about the gladiator which just came out yesterday as a game pass for 48 hours and I want to talk about is it worth it to buy it well I think it has the same stats as always I'm not sure but but you can use it uh, basically for a uh, star starter tower um, because it only costs 300 I mean uh, uh, you can place it uh, at the start so you don't have to deal with our zombies so at the start it deals two damage so that's pretty decent like for gladiator um, and it, it's pretty good like for a melee, melee power, the sledge does more damage but has a not faster but slower fire rate. Uh, I mean swing rate <laughs> because the gladiator has uh, at the start uh, he has one uh, swing rate. That means the fire rate. So. Then we have uh, the next level that gets free damage, and yeah. Mm. Oh. <laughs> so yeah, mm. the next level is uh, five and hidden detection, and that is pretty good. I don't know how. It's just weird, but it's pretty good. Like I see, uh, the next level goes from five to ten, and it retrieves an ability called Warrior's Call. Uh, you wonder what that ability called? And why? This is a, a boost of the swing rate. So, so when you activate the ability, then uh, the warrior. I mean the gladiator uh, swing rate just goes like shredded <laughs> like a shredder really the combined with commander is just much better so yeah it's, so that's a good sign so yeah mm, next level is uh, damage from 10 to 0.5 and the, the swing rate will go from 1 to 0 0.75 and that is like faster it deals more damage wow so yeah that's basically the, the strongest melee tower i can see right now so yeah then we have the last level that costs a bit. It costs a bit, but don't worry. Uh, it deals now uh, 25 to 40 damage. Range increases from 5 to 6. And swing rate from 0 0.75 to 0 0.5. And that is just crazy. What I see. But at the last level, the gladiator just looks insane it just looks like uh, the game pass icon so yeah that's, that's just crazy like for the gladiator I promised the versus series of the gladiator versus the sledger but I'm not um, gonna do it right now but another day so everyone is gonna be patient so yeah, so now the real question is, is the gladiator worth to buy with the box? Well, it costs 500 the box, which means it's, it doesn't cost uh, the, the same as the shredder did. Uh, it's now called slasher, but it's still called shredder because that's what I heard. 
so so the sweater was uh, 400 robux uh, and the gladiator is 500 robux so that means uh, the shredder could be like uh, less stronger than the gladiator that means that why in my opinion costs a lot of robux and I think it's worth to buy and why because it literally deals uh, a lot of damage on max level it can be uh, pretty useful for hordes like the normal normals and speedies or the normal bosses that come out from these stupid mysteries and much more and it can be uh, it can be used uh, to place uh, before uh, the game starts and you don't get healed as much damage as you expected and this is the most epic thing so I was testing the gladiator for a bit and yeah it is worth to buy so the reasons is just basically it's strong enough to beat the slow boss but when you get to a swim to you have to play something so yeah so yeah basically everything like for the video and thanks for watching and yeah it's worth to buy so go buy quick before it's gone forever because it will fly out to heaven and here's the max level gladiator like from the icon the game pass yeah it's cool okay anyways thanks for watching and see you guys tomorrow peace